All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is The Elder Scrolls for Oblivion, Part One Hundred Two, One Hundred Two, and uh, it's been a long, long time since we've been able to make a proper drop off. Braville was able to buy some of our stuff, but not a lot of it, and Leowin was able to buy almost nothing. So, in reality, we've gone through all of this, all of this, and all of Blackwood, and this higher up area here, as long as this, as well as this stuff, without being able to drop off our stuff. And so our weight has gone out of control, and we need to get to the Imperial City. So that's going to be what we do from here on out. We're going to work our way back down here, make sure we didn't miss anything here, and then once we get to here, we're just going to go ahead and ride the west coast until we get back to the Imperial City. So there will definitely be some more locations between us and getting back where we need to be, but it's also, you know, the kind of sunlight that kills us right now, so we're going to have to deal with that as well. Yep. Sorry, I'm going to ignore that bear. We don't have the ability to acknowledge that bear. We're about to train our restoration a lot doing this, because I think it might be a bit before we actually find somewhere to hide ourselves away from the sun, unfortunately. Come on. Come on. There it is. We're probably going to use some weak potions of healing, the works. Um, because this is really going to hurt. Really going to hurt. And weak potions of healing are something we can afford to get rid of, I think. To also free up some weight as well. Okay, that'll work. So where are we on the map? Okay, so this is that lake right here. Okay, there's a fort over there. Good. That's what we're shooting for. Let's get inside. The stage 4 vampire stuff is also really brutal on us. I mean, it's cool that we can raise our mysticism now. We can even do it at stage 3 now with its new level. But we need to get <laughs> down a stage so that we can... We need to get down our stages so that we can just be out in the sun without dying. Okay, here we are. Fort something. I don't even know what it said. We're in Fort Coopter. Okay. Very good. Whew. Very, very good. So let's go ahead and get the fire bow back out. And let's get to work in Fort Coopter. Really? That missed? Really? Oh my god. Oof. Tough lady. There it is. Alright. Three elven arrows back. Thank you. Two strong potions of healing. Three strong potions of source. It's gonna be one of these locations where I love every single opponent because they all drop valuable stuff. Apprentice Alembic. Ooh, I see a child overalls no i want the gem why would i want child overalls stop just stop no parchment why would i want child overalls can i get rid of that please uh where are they what where'd they go they were zero gold, zero weight. So are they a quest thing down the line? I'm very confused. What? what? Huh? And there's no search function either. I don't think I'm ever going to find where those things went. Are they just gone? That's super strange. That is super strange. Okay, well, the child overalls are not on our person. So I suppose we don't need to worry about it. Quote unquote. I doubt that. Let's charge the cold day in hell with all these really small uh, souls we have. We have a lot of petties and stuff. There we are. 
We have two petty and four lesser to fill. We can get working on that. Ooh, I bet those Zeevil Eyes give Grand Souls too. We should have tried that. Okay, cool. That's a way forward. Uh, that's the way we came in. Where does this go? Well, there's a lot of there's a lot of directions here. Fort Cooter Battle Mains. Old wooden door. What goes this way? Hello. They're very perceptive. The fact that they could see us. Oh my god, skeletons out of nowhere. Whoa. They just they just fell in. They just piled in. Damn, their hitboxes are so wide. There we go. Alright, how many of these skeletons are real that we actually have to kill? Let's find out when I turn around here. These scrolls are so valuable. Alright, two of them, actually. Oh, it's a skeleton champion and it's guardian. Gotcha. So really, we just kill the skeleton champion and it's taken care of. I know this cold damage is probably not doing very well against this champion. Unfortunate. There it is where it is. We dealt with it. Very nice. Let's keep moving. Take our elven arrow back. We're also getting rid of some weight by spending these arrows. Potion of disbelief. Two petty soldiers with petty charges. Yeah. Sure. Ooh, these coffins are lootable. Nope, nothing there. Uh, common soldier that's empty. 46 gold and lock picks. Not bad. I don't know what that's all about. Those look like ribcage bones coming out of the ground. That looks like a lot. <laughs> oh, it's a dead end, isn't it? Okay. Sure. So that's as far as that goes. Battle mains are that way, and then we have something this way as well. Fancy little room here. Oh. No dice. Even with that heal, you're still screwed. Necromancer. Elven arrow. And three... A bunch of potions and scrolls I want. Oh my god, necromancer looting is great in Oblivion. They have so much valuable stuff. Where's the wraith at? There it is. Mysticism increased. Where's the wraith? There it is. Whoops. Interesting. It seems determined to stand in that specific spot. Ectoplasm, thank you for the wraith. For the coffin. Poison of silence, 53 gold and a lock. Alright, looks like that's the rest of this main area. So now we can go to the battle mains. Let's do it! I'm ready. Okay, wraiths have a weird life detection. Marksman skill increased. Keeps losing us again. Glad we're getting that marksman up. I look forward to the day we get it to 100 and we don't have to raise it anymore. We can just ignore all the arrows and stuff. When we start to get when we start to get close, I'll uh, utilize all the really good arrows. Uh oh. There it goes. What sees us? Necromancer's headless zombie, really? Where's the necromancer that sees us, and how did she pull that one off? Oh, detect life, I bet. I Because they're casters. Of course. Detect life. It all makes sense. That's pretty cool. 
makes sneaking really hard, but it's really cool. Come on. She is really good at dodging arrows. Now how are you going to dodge the arrows, huh? You dummy. Hmm? What are you going to do now, hmm? Oh, you're going to push me aside, aren't you? Yo, she's healing a lot. There's a lot of healing. Oh, that was a lich that I shot. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, hold up. I know cold damage hell's cold damage, but... Yeah, the frost damage effect is being completely resisted, isn't it? Ugh, that was not ideal. Okay. A lot of arrows to pick up here. This damn necromancer was really surprisingly tanky. And she was dodging even more. <sighs> Jesus, this, this mace is not good in this environment. Let's get this champion out of here. Oh my god! I thought I died. <laughs> the way the way we just got tossed? That was crazy. Xander has never just been thrown like that before. Skeleton champions, okay. Wow. Alright, skeleton champion. I see you. That was that was awesome, but crazy. I was like, did we just get one shot? Cause I know in Skyrim, when you die, you ragdoll into third person. So I my heart skipped a beat when I saw that. But no, we're good, we're good, we're good. A soul gem with nothing in it, 59 gold. That's not worth picking up. It's cool, but not worth picking up on our current weight limit. Strong invisibility potion. Wait, yes it is. Oh my god, there was something we dropped earlier that we should not have dropped. Those water walking boots were worth so much money. I did bad math. I did bad math that we don't that we didn't st that we don't ha still have those boots. That's an oops. Oh well. It let it let us move in the moment. It's a sacrifice we had to make, so to speak. Maybe not had to, but wait, we're up to almost seventy thousand without selling anything. We're over 69,000 gold, just raw. Another skeleton champion. Oof. Staggered me with an arrow. Rude. Uh-oh, what's hitting us? Don't give me dwarven arrows or steel arrows. Stop, 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 stop. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, a wraith. The frost damage is just not doing it. Hold up. Where's our uh, soul gems? Here they are. Two petty on the Senate Sigil Dagger. Let's just equip that for a second. Eight uses. Should be plenty. Seven. So it has one use left. That's kind of an awkward amount, but whatever. Uh, two lesser soul gems with lesser. Okay. A master retort. Do we need a retort? I think we already have a master retort. Yeah, we do. Damn. It's the mortar and pestle, pestle and calcinator that we need. One day we'll find them. One day. One day, one day. Alright. Let's uh, use the lessers on the cold day in hell. It's actually out of charge, basically. And I'd like to not have to use all my bow charges right away if I don't have to. Sneak attack for three times, really? I still don't know what's seeing us. Ah. Strength is drained. Is this bow out of charge? Yes, it is. I was wondering why it felt so weak. Ow. 
We got this. Bang. Oh, now we gotta wait for this drain to finish. Something is seeing us somewhere. And I'm not sure what is seeing us somewhere. I actually got no idea. Let's use a strong potion of sorcery to keep training while we're stuck here. There we go. Man, what sees us? That's not the one we want. Skeleton champion. Another one. Starting to run into a lot of those. Okay. We're getting it. There it is. Champion down. Claymore of pain. Drain health. What? Oh my god, 15 points for 6 seconds? Is that 90 points of drain? I don't think so. But it could be. Petty soul gem that's empty. Weakness to disease, yeah. Alacrity, charisma, alacrity I think is what it's supposed to be. Novice mortar and pestle. Calcinator? Novice as well. Okay. Worth a shot. Worth hoping. Worth hoping. A greater soul. Hey, hey. That's cool that how that was like a little hidden area right there. Okay, we got plenty of areas down. Plenty of enemies downstairs in the battle maze. Really? That was cool. I've never been so locked out like that before. Oh, no, now we need to figure out another way down there. Is that the deal? increased okay this is just a well wraiths and stuff down there ah now we need to drop down okay all right <laughs> but not with that oh, boy. oh no that was not ideal that was not ideal. That was not ideal. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, we're gonna use a Grand Soul on uh, the Ascendant Sigil Dagger because we need uses on this thing ASAP. Because all these undead things don't care about cold damage. Oh my god, what? A Nether Lich's Skeleton Champion. Oh my god, stop, 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 stop. Oh, wow, we were taking damage. Oh, wow, we were taking damage. I saw our health start to drop. Not in one game, one life. No, sir. Time to use some resources. That's not even a threat. Okay, weak potions of healing. We'll dr drink the four. It lets us drink right away. Okay. Okay, Thread Zombie was hitting us, too. Over and covered. Okay. This is one big trap, isn't it? God. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is crazy. Okay. Dread zombie taken care of. <laughs> Sorry I got quiet. I was really focusing. Oh my gosh. Xander. That was not okay. Yep, busted. Strength is being drained. <sighs> okay. If you say so, Faded Wraith. Super rude of you to do, by the way. Alright, I'll do this then. If you're not going to let me shoot from, hit you from melee, I'll just shoot you from range. There. Jesus. Difficulty's really spiked recently. 
This place is deadly. I dig it, but I'm also scared. Because that was really bad. Okay, there's our lever to get out, I think. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, that was rough. That was really rough. Xander hasn't been pushed to use healing potions on anything except sun damage in a long time. But, uh, this time he did. This place forced it out of him. We had to use a grand soul to recover a sigil dagger. The whole nine yards. Greaves of freedom. That's way too heavy. Cool, but way too heavy. Thanks anyway. Ouch. That hurt. But okay, I believe that is everything. We are out of here. Yep, that's it. That's Fort Battle Mains. Or Fort Coopter. Fair enough. That was a cool locale. That was a cool locale. More difficult than I thought it would be just by going to a fort. It's five in the afternoon. Damn. So it's still gonna hurt out here. Rain? No rain. I'm going west. Okay, there's a camp. That's not gonna do it, but it's something. Uh, hello? Replenish? Magicka? Okay, there's a there's a cave past it. Very nice. There's gonna be bandits here I can't really contend with because of the sun. We might even have to come back. Neon camp. I think I just saw someone disappear on us. Bandit hedge wizard? Goodbye. <laughs> even hit him extra. Okay. Make sure we're not missing anything here. Nope, looks like it's just an ordinary bandit camp. Alright. See ya. You'd think our, our, our respiration would be higher than it is. Okay, what did we find? We found Lost, <laughs> Lost Boy Cavern. Oh, this is cool. Look at this inch. Like, oh. That looks really cool. I like that a lot. Well then. Okay. The like, uh, entrance to this place is really cool looking. This no longer looks really cool looking. Now it just looks dark and dreary. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Almost got seen by another lich. These guys are not nice. And they use the tech life so they can always see you. Damn. Okay. Let's use uh, encumbrance because that's about to be an issue. And then, uh, man, it's out of charge again. We're out of charges with basically everything. Not quite, but you know we're getting there. Oh, we're out of arrows. Well, at least of that stack. We still have glass arrows, but we're out of elven arrows. Wow. Okay, this is a full full wraith. One that actually does need to die. So, we'll take care of that, I guess. Come on. Get out of the way. You're good training, I guess, but we really don't need you here. Nether Lich. Go ahead and do your little float thing. There it is. Alright. Another lich down. Sure, we'll take three elven arrows back. Why not? Okay, let's keep moving. Xander getting pressed lately. A lot of it's because we just don't have charges on our weapons. We're going to have to use a barla stone again soon. For better or worse. Is that a necromancer? Yes, it is. 
A dead one. 43 gold. All right, let's keep let's keep it moving. Get both glass arrows back. How lucky. Immolating touch tone. Yeah, we'll give it a look. Lost Boy Canyon. <laughs> the place of this. The fact that the entrance looks so cool and the fact that it's called Lost Boy really has me intrigued. Weakness to fire, 100% for 6 seconds. Fire damage, 30 points for 6 seconds. Whoa! That's really good. How much does it cost? 234. Yikes. Okay, that's Lost Boy Canyon. Let's see what the rest of this place has for us before we go into a different area. Pretty sure there was a turn we didn't take. Yeah, a couple of them, actually. This wasn't exactly the direction I was trying to go on the map, but we were just desperate for the cover of night. Had to take what we could get. Does this also go to the canyon? To the yawning halls? Hmm. So that is different. A Daedric battle axe. Oh, if they just didn't cost... If they weren't 76 pounds. That's so many pounds. Wow, he's handling these shots very well. I guess it's out of charge. Our bow's out of charge. Okay, well... We're out of charge with everything except for the Cold Day in Hell, which has seven uses left, so... I think we're about to have to use that Varla Stone in a sec. Don't throw us again. Got blocked by the guy behind him. Only in Oblivion. Alright, let's kill this guy before we use the Varla Stone, though. There you go. Alright. Very good. Time for a Varla Stone usage. And that'll put us down to 14 left. Now we can get Rock Shatter back out. Um, Transcendent Sigil Mace is on 8 if we need a little more oomph. Gotta love those Varla Stones. We are, there is a limited amount of those in the game, so... One day we're not gonna have any more. Hopefully Xander will be in a very comfortable spot by then. But we'll see. We'll see. Okay, so that's this direction. Now there's just that one turn left. It looks like it's not going to add up to much, but we should check it. Should check it. There is stuff. For sure. Two skeletons. Oh, I think I could have stayed in sneak, actually. My bad. You rock shatter is not very good. <laughs> no, I took a weapon on accident. What did I pick up? What did I pick up? I definitely picked up a weapon on accident. Bow of freezing. There it is. Ow. It's just champions. That's really all we find anymore. It's just champion after champion. Man, Rock Shatter does not keep up. This poor thing. Blunt skill increased, okay. Still working on that. Ooh, nice block. Didn't even get two swings in before he blocked us. Wow. Okay, skeleton champion. Actually, I think we're getting blocked by the guy in the back. All right. All said and done, things are going pretty good in here. Rock Shatter's probably almost used up because of how weak it is. 20 uses left. It just doesn't do a lot of damage. It just does not do a lot of damage. Let's take a look at our levels here. We are halfway to 22. Wow. Our alteration's about to go up again. Uh, our mysticism is at 32. So... 
35 if Alteration goes up one more time. Alteration's gonna go up again. Honestly, we could just get Mysticism to 34, and then we can call it for a level, because Alteration's probably gonna get to 44 this level. Blunt's up to 61. Armor is up to 74. One more level up in armor, and we can repair things to 125%. Another reason we're gonna want to go to the Imperial City is to get a ton of repair hammers to be able to utilize that extra power we could have. We just, in so many ways, shapes, and forms, we just need to get ourselves to the Imperial City ASAP. So that's what we're working on. Let's go to the canyon first. Not much of a canyon yet. Okay. Okay. Now it's looking like a canyon. We got our necromancer here. Okay, yeah, he does see us. Come back here. Come back. There you go. Um, we should have the Mace of the Dynamo actually ready to go on 8 for when we face human opponents. I forgot about that. Because human opponents we can't soul trap. So they're the perfect targets for that kind of thing. A Nether Lich from across the way. No way he sees us. Are you serious? No, those are definitely sneak attacks. Yeah. It said we were being seen, but I don't think so. Not from that distance, I don't think. Wait, that's a dead drop. That's like you die if you fall. Oh my. I don't like that. Those should not be in here. Oh my god. That one's not a deadfall. Okay. Oh my god, I didn't- I didn't even- Have we seen a deadfall yet in Oblivion? I don't remember one. That's scary. That they exist in Oblivion. One wrong step, we could lose Xander. That's spooky. Is that another deadfall? That's another deadfall. Oh my god. Spooky scary. I don't like being on these bridges even in case they have some like, bridge collapses event. <laughs> Forget that. Okay. It looks like Lost Boy Canyon's actually gonna take a while. So we should probably call this a part because I'm running out of time, actually. Sorry. Son of a. Okay, you know what? We're rock shattering. There we go. It's not a great weapon, but it gets the job done. And I hate having to shoot around these enemies. Yeah, alright. So, I do have to actually call this one here. Even though we're in the middle of a, a location. Because I actually am running out of time. I This, this turned into a lot. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. And if you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. Either way, thank you so much for joining Xander and I on this journey, and we will see you next time.